Welcome back everyone to Let's Play Supreme Ruler Ultimate as Texas episode number 8 in the Shattered World start. Let's go back over here. I think I, I mean I want to impose a challenge on myself. I want to see if I can take all of Oklahoma in the time it takes for this AI battle or war to conclude. It is, it's actually been a lot of fun to watch. I don't know if other people feel that way, but it's, to me it's really interesting to watch these two because they appear to be um, not perfectly balanced. I think that Marseille, I mean, just given the fact that it, they wouldn't have declared war unless they thought they could win, right? One would assume. So I'm, I'm, I'd give a pretty sizable advantage to Marseille. But southern Germany is, is really holding its own pretty well so far. Now, there's been a little bit of back and forth, precarious back and forth, and we thought, I thought that we had seen the, the end come in the last video where they did break through, which is continuing here, except for Freiburg, Freiburg I should say. Freiburg is holding out <laughs> heroically, it's completely cut off, has only two artillery units besides the garrisons, but garrisons in this game are very powerful. So that, unless you push strongly and, you know, from all, you have to have a sizable force. Garrisons just don't, they don't just tip over and they regenerate pretty quickly. Oh, there's another Leclerc. Um, I tried to narrow down the number of battles and stuff. They're basically all the dialogue boxes clear them out. So South Carolina, Congo, that's not a big deal. The only interesting one that I thought, oh, North Caucasus and Sicily, I don't know if they're, they probably won't, well, can they? Oh, what? Where's North Caucasus? Yeah, okay. <laughs> so this is, what would this be? Like Georgia, Azerbaijan. Uh, I don't know what this area is up here. I mean, Chechnya? Huh, not sure. So they declared war on somebody they can't reach. So that, that in other words, is not a big deal. India and northern China reach a ceasefire, and I, I don't usually care about ceasefires, but that that's an important one. We completed two of our military facilities um, over in Panama. Okay, you are giving me a good deal. Yeah, it looks like the end is nigh over here for southern Germany. And I, just as I say that, they counter push. I mean, they have a sizable stock of things here, and it looks like a lot of artillery. As long as they're getting supply, they're going to be doing a lot of damage. I mean, ultimately, the only thing I really care about is that we're minimizing the number of enemy combatant units out there. Oh, it looks like I have actually gotten them to awaken their forces. Okay, so what are we up against here? Common engineers. Now, because these are all, all American forces, I would like to capture as many as possible. The goal here should be just to, like, seriously circumvent any hot spots and try not to kill units very difficult to do but if we can let's try to blitz through and take cities actually maybe i can declare war and then yeah let's see what angle they come at me from we're more or less okay we'll probably get these abrams up here just so they're in a better reaction position i just have this okay we we actually have plenty of good stuff over there well pfft. We have artillery defended by really nothing. I thought I sensed something up that way. Maybe not. Yeah, so we'll have plenty of Abrams. I think I'll park these guys right here. It's probably all the stuff we're gonna commit with. I guess I could probably dig out some more infantry from the reserves. I do think a lot of the reserves have already been activated. Okay, reserves. Yeah, well, we still have a number of Green Berets. Oh, awesome! Our future combat system, they're, they're actually finishing up. And the Leopards are finishing? Hey, that's awesome. Uh, Green Berets, not exactly the definition of lightning warfare. Let's actually get some of these into the fight. Let's use them to hopefully bum rush some some cities and stuff like that. Oklahoma City. So yeah, let's let's actually bring them up over here. And we have two others that 
Wow. Still going to be fun, I think, to get them to the end of the fight. How about if we do it this way? What if we attack Oklahoma City by going up the highway and turning west and coming in from the from the east side? Again, we want to minimize the amount of contact with the, the enemy military. As many of these units as we can keep, the better. The more, the better. Okay, waste management three. Let's check what that was. Assuming that's a society one. Doesn't look like we have waste management two, which is a little bit unusual, but anyway. Finished goods or demand, minus 10%. Industrial outputs, plus 2%. Okay, fair enough. Oh, Iran and UAE have gone to war. Serbia and southern Germany have reached ceasefire. Well, no, it's pretty, no crap. <laughs> pretty obvious. Nobody wants to be at war when they're getting overrun. I mean, how's this? It kind of stabilized again. Eventually, the you know the they'll keep bashing heads until one of them just has an overwhelming number, and then they'll be able to push in. The garrisons, I think, kind of get worn down over time. All right, so I think we will put our M1 Abrams or the M1A2s into this fight um, because I I think that it's going to be worthwhile to just as quickly as possible get to the, the capital. So I kind of set up these troops like, oh yeah. They're probably not going to be used in the end, but the time has come to declare war. Uh, well, almost. The only thing I need to double check is the positions of my aircraft. I think we're all set here, so one is there. I don't have two hockey. Well, two will become this then. I don't have three hockey. Okay, you guys are going to become three then. Five is here, six is artillery, and seven is artillery. That's all fine. I don't mind that. I guess I should wait for my future combat system people to get into position. Where are they coming from? So I did they end up building down here? Oh, they did. I didn't build the leopards down there intentionally. Okay, let's get the leopards into action too. I mean, normally I have this you know kind of OCD system of always fighting with my weakest units so that they all die. And then I'm left with only the best stuff. Of course, it's always a, it's a never-ending battle. Because by the time the next war comes along, I'm already at a new technology. And what was the, the previous best is now the second best. So then that ends up being the ones that fight. I never end up fighting with the good stuff unless I'm, you know, it's all hands on deck and I'm really being overrun. Which is pretty rare. Oops, I don't want those artillery. I'm going to try to minimize the number of artillery at least until we get to cities. But just in case, we'll put some... Yeah, maybe we'll just drive cross-country. I think that supply might be a bit of an issue in this because... not. I mean, it's, there's not a whole lot of here. Hopefully our supply just propagates forward very nicely. Yeah, 46%. That's not a promising starting point. I wonder if it's worth building. It's going to take too long to get there. Okay, well, it's, it's, it's too late. Paris? Oh, Slovenia. I was like, Paris? But no, that's not Marseille. Yep. Things have actually kind of stabilized. Okay, there the counter push is still going on. So we have time to take Oklahoma still. <laughs> and it is 2021. I would I could not I actually was surprised that we made it so far in this game because we started in 2020. So in in basically 2 years, Texas has taken all of Central America, New Mexico, and before the end of the year, let's include one more state in the tally. Okay. So Everything's in position. I think we're good to go. Now, I'm expecting their air quickly. My air has been activated and is ready to go. I probably am going to have to break these off into two groups. Maybe that's why I was doing this. Okay, let's... Four, three, and let me get these guys to be one and you to be two. So we're going to have two response groups. Just move into Lawton as fast as possible. 
Are you artillery? What is... Who's, who's opening up? Oh my god, my artillery is hitting them from there? <laughs> Holy smokes. Alright, we wanted these guys to move together, so let's do it this way. Yep, just go right on up the road. You guys can charge into there and die, but then as soon as you're done... This is M60s? Yeah, good. But as soon as you're done... Okay, they are moving this way. Okay, well, maybe we can just bum rush the capital. I don't know. We're gonna try it. All right, the SCS is ready to go. Oh, here they come. So that's, uh, what do we want this? A longbow Apache? I mean, I do, I do want a longbow Apache. This is the craziest thing. I want, <laughs> we're gonna have to stop something, right? We're not gonna be able to keep everything. Oh my gosh, if that's doing that much damage to us, then all right. Well, I really wish we could have kept you, but okay, that's that's good. Don't don't pursue, don't pursue. In fact, go back down this way. Don't hurt them. Don't you dare. Good. Return to base. Now that's gonna go into um, the repair, and this is good. We're push. We are pushing pretty strong over there. You know, I don't mind not having the M two seven two eights. So I will pause for a moment just to kill those. Five, you move up, and damn, that just takes so long. Uh, seven, where's seven? Six, six, okay. You guys are moving together. Move up, move up. Yeah, I guess just go take that first part. Um, you go here, and you guys are just gonna move on in, and probably end up just moving like this. Helicopters, where are we needed? Where are you needed? I don't know. Probably in this fight. So if it's just those engineer vehicles, I'm okay. I'm pretty okay with that. What is this? So the M1s, I don't care about either, frankly. Okay, well, good thing, because here we go. M60A3 versus M1. M1. These guys are cut off, but that's just for a moment. Let's get the strikers to reinforce. And get, oh, these, these guys are prime, but we definitely want those guys in the front. Back up so you can kill these things. Who is injured here? Oh, my recon. Have the recon step back. Oh, I don't want to hurt you. Go away, Mr. Bradley. Go away. M1 Abrams. I'm not going to worry about the M1 Abrams. Okay, that I don't want to kill. Move out of the way. Don't kill him. Don't kill him. Good, 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 good. Okay. <clears throat> well, we can sell the M1s. They're really not that... They're not useless, of course. What is going on here? Oh, we actually did take that already. Okay, then quickly take their military base as well. Uh, these are garrisons. Move in there. Okay, you guys are good. This is what we want. Push in there. Um, number five, move here. You guys move here. That's good. I mean, we're just, these guys. Look how long they take to do anything. Oh, they just aren't moving because they aren't supposed to take. It's all AA. Oh, whoops. Okay, have the Marines lead the way then. AA doesn't want to go into places first on its own. Reopen the supply lines. Okay, get six over here. Have these guys continue to move forward. Alright, Green Berets. I know that we don't really want you to get involved, but we'll just have you slide a little bit more forward. Okay, we did take all this. Our Leopards are getting slaughtered by frickin' garrisons. Well, let's not have that. Let's do this instead. Move them forward. Um, these two leopards can be can help out, but the green berries should take care of that pretty quickly. All right, let's move in. Uh, what is this? Okay, M1. I'm fine with that. Do you guys have not? Do you guys not have supply? Forget. Okay. Well, we are pretty close. Let's let's call in our air support. Somewhere I have. Real air support? Oh, speaking of air support. 
get both of them on the main city, Oklahoma City. Can you imagine Oklahoma's, I mean, it's just so, circumstances of this are so bizarre. Oklahoma City being bombed by Texans. <laughs> it's, just, it's, it's just crazy. Um, somewhere though, we do have, okay, you just get yourself like over there-ish for an emergency. But somewhere, there we go. Wait, do you have supply? You do. Carry a little bit. So let me have you just escort. You're not a tanker, are you? No. Wait. Yeah, you're not. Escort. Any of those. You'll probably take a little bit of AA in the meantime, but... Actually, the F-16s and F-111s will probably take care of that. Yeah, this is good. This is good. Oh, boy. What do we have here? They brought their own Super Hercules. <laughs> And their shadow tanker. We definitely don't want to kill those. Okay. So I need to go to the F 16s and ask them not to engage in air uh, air targets. Yeah. So I turn that off just so we don't kill them. Is this helping? 47. No, not really, huh? So if they're out of supply, they're useless to stand there. What we need is a supply truck. I thought we had supply trucks somewhere. So this whole group just has to charge on in there. And get you onto the railroad. Where are our supply trucks? Nowhere? Somewhere. Um, just keep advancing, taking territory. It's likewise over here. Okay, six has a uh, six. Okay, so six goes here, and the supply truck actually goes in. Supply truck here goes there. Good. Uh, yeah. Actually, just stop here. So I don't think you're doing any good, Mr. Hercules. You might just be a troop transport. You should be able to provide supply though. Oh, my, what, what are we losing here? I need to see. M113, 2nd Marines, M113. M109A2. Oh, dear. Where did, where did that happen? Oh, no. Did I have the wrong ordering or something? That's a bummer. We definitely don't want to lose. That's this is my good artillery. Yeah, they they had, they had a number done on them. It's like ah, had to sneeze. Okay, well it looks like we can start pushing up the road. Man, the Green Berets are really keeping it together for us. So what about sending you guys back in? Um, let's have you guys mix over here. Alright, go ahead and take it. It's fine, we, we let them mess around with things long enough. Oh my gosh, you're in a river. <laughs> Whoops. Get the helicopters to support. Get this guy in there. I mean, just anybody. Go take it. Crying out loud. F-A-18C, I don't think this has ground support in a big way. Not really. Much better at air support. Okay, we'll, we'll leave it be for now. Always these recon ones getting pounded. Okay, go on in. I think we're just trying to take bite off more than we can chew here, taking a few too many things. Let's get this leopard out of here. Um, yeah, we need to fly more air missions in. Yikes. One more at least. Do they have AA in there? They do, they have a stinger. 
I mean, okay, well, the, once the Green Berets come in, we should have, like, no problem. Where are the Green Berets? I thought I had a batch. There they are. Okay. Yeah, so these guys can probably just go right into the capital. I'm pretty sure that they will be able to just charge in. They're, they're such good attack power. Meanwhile, we were held off. <laughs> this one garrison. Oh, brother. <laughs> These garrisons are just insane. Okay, we're almost there. I don't want to lose a patent, but... Oh, we're so close. Oklahoma City, I think that's it. Okay, we're so close. M113, Marines, M113. Those are all acceptable losses. Um, where's this? Okay, yeah. I don't know if I did this off camera or on camera, but I did decide on a military base down at the edge of the border with Columbia. And we can scrap. There's like quite a few industrial places that I'm getting rid of. Since they had, um, like, was it other for their power supply? They were doing like windmills. And we all know windmills are just silly. Anybody in the world will tell you. We have coal. Let's just burn coal instead. <laughs> so that's what we do. Romania and Sweden. That's weird. We took their capital. Oh, we did it. Please fall. Please. 700 million. I mean, that's... That's not bad. We have 81 million because I've started selling oil. <laughs> so we don't really need that much, but. And so, I mean, so it's just inconsequential compared to the amount we have. However, what does this mean? Uh, approaching base here. I'll send two leopards back to defend it. Okay, finally the green berets are moving in there. Did my helicopters all die? Where did they, where did they go? Where are you guys? Huh. They moved home. Alright, well let's do some bombardment on this. Hopefully don't that we don't kill that Bradley. Yeah, good. Just bomb it. Just take the cities. Good. Alright, we did it. We did it. Get five into here. Link them up. Six. We're six. Six goes here. Uh, I think it's gotten a little chaotic here at the end. Glad we didn't lose the Strikers or the Bradleys. The Recon Bradleys, they're just, they're not that good. And what are you doing? Oh, yeah, we'll take you. We lost one and that's our replacement right there. Oh, no, their new capital is Tulsa. Okay, well, let's see if we can just blitz it. <clears throat> Maybe we can get lucky here. Okay, six. My dear friends, move over here. So you can get close to the capital. And we want to move down this road as well. And we're just going for it. Oh, that's an M1A2. That's something we have to take very seriously. <clears throat> I think we're going to run over this little... Huh, looks like solar plants. So this is power other, if I'm not mistaken. Ew, gross. Solar power, wind power, all those things. They're just... Yeah. Unnecessary. Just unnecessary. Okay, M1A2 over to here to hell. Oh gosh, that was a good move. Oh boy. I don't want to kill you. Get out. What are you doing? I think that one's going down. We're going to lose a recon Bradley here. There's no way I'm going to be able to get him out in time. However, I think we are going to have to put up a fight against this threat. So in we go. All right, get out of here. Now, don't kill him. Just disarm him. Don't 
kill him, damn it. Anyhow, those are expensive. But, you know, whatever. Live first. Alright, get these guys into the fight. We should be good now. Let me just bring up the artillery so we can more quickly bombard and eliminate. It's probably all we have left to do. Oh, looks like the capital's open. We took their capital. Again. Please surrender. Please surrender. Not that I care. Oh! Oh! What happened? Alright, we took another 500 million. We did lose an M1A2. Oh my god, we lost an M1A2. And a Bradley. Well, hopefully that's enough to end this war. Where would their capital even be at this point? I don't know. I don't really have anything that great. Move down here and maybe put some pressure on these M1A2s. Oh my god, please don't die, though. Okay, we need somebody to go take Broken Arrow. That's a whole war is gonna start. Oh god, we almost lost another one. Please get out. <laughs> Only just barely. Okay, there's another M1A2. Please surrender. We could really use those forces. Oh my god, don't do it. It's suicide. Let's try to move back. Just move back and forth, like we are giving up ground just to not kill people. That didn't work at all, but they are going back to repair, thank goodness. Okay, but somebody has to move in and take the city, crying out loud. Oh god, I hope this doesn't... Just in case it triggers all... yeah, I don't want to do that. Get back in there. We're not we aren't gonna harm you. We Please go about your business. Did I just take their capital again? Okay, I've taken their capital three times. They, they there must be nothing left. Yeah. Military approval rating's down to sixty five. Domestic's still at twenty three, not bad. How are things over here? Yeah, southern Germany has completely stabilized. That's impressive. Also, this war has only gone on for like three weeks. Okay, move on in, quickly. Let's take these places. Oh my gosh, they got a new capital, that's fine. I have some Green Berets kind of in the area. We can send some M1A2s up there. Uh, whatever we have, we're gonna start sending, that's for sure. Oh, we can get some Leopards. Move this way, perhaps. That guy's bombarding still. What a ding dong. All right, this one, we're going to move right up to the south as well. Here we go. Let's take this capital and hopefully end this war. It's a silly war. Oh, yeah, they have so... They have really good aircraft. <gasps> Don't do it! Don't do it! I, I, will, I need to fly them out of here. Okay, I can do it this way. Don't attack air. <laughs> Don't do anything. We can sell those. We're like we're we're like we become pirates. <laughs> Don't you're gonna break it? We need to scrap that later. So take them take them off the front. I think is the the first message. Okay, this looks like it's gonna go really good for us very quickly, and that's good. I don't really care about waiting for Green Braves or whatnot to show up. We just need to end Oklahoma. The Red River Red River rivalry must end. Succumb. This is happening pretty quickly. I think we're gonna get in nicely. We took their capital. We took their capital. Wait, no, 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 no. Okay, so just give them time. Give them time. Let them get out with any aircraft. What's going on here? 
An M113? Well, I mean, we lost a few. We wouldn't mind. Are you kidding me? Stillwater? <laughs> Stillwater is their capital? you got to be kidding me. All right. About face. Forward march. On we go. Uh, let's have those guys. Okay, so... That I'm going to have my leopards guard. I hope they just don't do that. Okay, good. Do we take still water? No. But let's get our um, Nighthawks to help out here. Because these aren't moving as quickly as I so was hoping. Uh, let's get these guys up. Okay, so far so good. So far so good. And I, I do want to reactivate their ability to kill aircraft. Because I, I can see myself forgetting about that, which would not be good. Anyways, let's quickly get into the fight here. Get in, get in, get in. Go, 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 go. We took their okay, we've taken four of their capitals. The treasure benefits are, you know, decreasing. A lot of diminishing returns here. What next? Don't do it, don't do it. I'm 60. Okay. I ah, don't do it. What are you doing? Get out of here, you ding dong. What are you doing? Oh, he made it. Wow. By the skin of his teeth. Do they really have it? Oh my gosh, no! That's their military base with all the precious cargo. Oh man. I, I'm a little bit surprised. This is the first time I've seen them hold on so long. Now, what happens, I think, is. When the civilian rating um, and diplomatic rating goes down too low, that's when they do fight to like pretty much the bitter end. So that is what we're seeing here, unfortunately. To the point where I probably am going to have to take like every single city, which is most unfortunate. Wow, we did lose a lot of artillery there. But it's okay. I mean, we can always refit, reform. Let's get this group. 60s to the front. Um, I want to try to take this as quickly as possible. Okay, yes, just get them out of there. Get them out of there. Good. Oh, the all the good stuff left, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, go, go. Go in. Go in. Go in. Go in. And six. You guys are already firing. Yes, perfect. Five. You guys can get a little closer. on in. Now we don't actually want everyone to go in once we do take their last non-garrison unit. I mean their last garrison. This is a lot of fire. <laughs> okay, so let's have everyone here just sit here and have... What's a, a pretty resilient unit that... Oh yeah, you back up. You're my new precious toy. Yeah, how about these M60s go in? No, no, not, don't, don't, do it, don't do it. Okay, back up, just back up. Everyone back up. Sit, stay. We did it! Oh, we did it! <laughs> Annex. All right, these are now <laughs> our friends. Oh, right, all right, all right. What do we get? We got an M113, M60, we got a replacement howitzer, another howitzer over here, um, a predator which will sell, and a globemaster, which, what are you, what are you, oh my gosh, amazing. So we'll definitely keep this thing around. Three billion dollars a year to maintain it. Woof, whoops, I didn't cancel those orders. Or basically, I just do this, right? Wow, that was exciting. Okay, and that's the end of this episode. But before we do anything else, let me just kind of tell everyone to go repair who needs it desperately. Um, yeah, I, I guess I can do this off camera. So I'll do this off camera. What I wanted to look at, though, before we you know, go is just how are things going over here? If I'm not mistaken, this is actually a full offensive by the Germans now. 
Now, look at this. I mean, infrastructure has just been devastated. Well, just this one. It's on pause. They're probably, you know, just broke. I imagine... Uh, but this is... Yeah, there's definitely some some real fighting going on here. Oh my gosh, this, this is a really cool war. This is perhaps the most interesting AI war I've ever seen. Because it's just so well balanced. And it looks like the... Yeah, the Germans have air cover. Although I think the French still have numerical superiority. And look at that, they have a Leclerc hiding out here. With artillery and some infantry. It's a good fight. I think it'll be fun to get over here. I mean, hey, our fight was, was very cool too. But it was American versus American. I think it'll be a little bit more interesting. Like, their situation is German versus French. So you have a slightly different design. So that's pretty cool. Um, I guess I'm going to call a video to a close here. So let me just do that. We'll pick this up in the next episode. Um, I'll probably start lining... I, I don't even know what our next obvious target is. But look at this. This, ladies and gentlemen, is Texas. The great empire of Texas. Oh, there goes the, the panhandle. Now we just have a, a nice unified block. If we want to block out, I think that we should probably take Arizona next. That would probably help make us a nice big block. That's my gut feeling. So we'll see about that. But we'll figure it out in the next episode. Until then, thanks for watching. Stay safe and take care.